Nafash, a brood mother, took part of the swarm to the frozen moon Calder, where she is fighting a Protoss expedition. Nafash's brood had many highly evolved creatures. To reunite the swarm, you will need those adaptations. The scouts report that Nafash set up a hive on this plane, but abandoned it shortly after. She moved off into those ice valleys. That must be where the Protoss are. You have said you wish revenge on the leader of the Terrans, but there are no Terrans on this moon. Nafash's brood has valuable adaptations. I need them to strengthen the swarm so that I can take down Minsk. Surely my brood alone could defeat his forces. Terrans are weak. Isn't that what you thought about me? I cannot detect the Dark Templar. Is he hidden on the Leviathan, waiting to strike? He's gone. Whatever agenda he's pursuing, he's not a threat to me. Not right now, at least. Isn't anything not Zerg a threat to us? Do not question me, Isha. As you say, my queen. Swarm suffering on this moon. I thought you'd made my Zerg stronger than this. Calder as cold as deep space. Other than Leviathan, no reason to specialize swarm for such cold. Is that an excuse? Wasteful to spin unnecessary adaptations. Complexity bad. Not needed before. Needed now. We'll look for local fauna. Essence useful for swarm adaptation. Do it. Nafash moved her brood into these ice valleys to fight the Protoss. It is unknown if she will join you willingly. This moon has pockets of intense cold, called flash freeze storms. One such storm is approaching. It will push temperatures down so fast that almost all thermal energy will be lost. 
The storm will pass quickly, but while it is here, your troops will be frozen in place. I can sense indigenous creatures nearby. Their matriarchs have powerful essence, strong enough to help us adapt to this cold. Out with it. There's not much time. Get going. I have to find an Ursodon matriarch and get her essence. This world is mine. This Zerg is feral. It is not under the control of any higher entity. This world is mine. Who asked you? Another feral roach. Something is very wrong. What is it now? The flash freeze is near. I just have to find an Ursodon matriarch. The flash freeze has arrived. Your troops are frozen. These Ursodon, led by Matriarch, strong essence. Once local essence assimilated, Swarm will resist Flash Freeze. The Flash Freeze is ending. Essence assimilated. Swarm resistant to flash freeze. Excellent. And now I can sense Nefasha's hive cluster nearby. Injured roaches able to burrow, regain health. Nefasha's brood. The Protoss must have wiped them out. I'll awaken this hive cluster for the swarm. The Protoss sense the awakening. They are aware of our presence. The Queen of Blades. But what has happened to you? Frail and human. Protoss, I wondered when you'd show yourselves. We must inform Shakuras. They will send the Golden Armada. They will destroy you. Isha, tell me the Protoss are out of range of Shakuras. They are, my queen. However, the Protoss have Silink Spires that can amplify their psionic communication. Then we destroy those Spires before the Protoss can activate them. Yes. Additional Matriarch Essence nearby. If collected, Swarm can become more efficient in Flash Freeze. I do like an efficient Swarm. If I have a chance, I will hunt down some matriarchs. Brave Protoss, slow her down. Take the fight to her. Protoss approaching the hive cluster. Flash freeze approaching. The Protoss will be vulnerable until it passes. The Protoss are defenseless. Attack now! Flash Freeze is passing. attention flash freeze will be here soon press our advantage destroy the protoss out with it Flash 
first freeze is passing. Who asked you? Get going. The Golden Armada will be your end. Flash freeze coming in soon. Press the attack. What is it now? A flash freeze storm has hit. The Protoss are defenseless. Attack now. Our voices are under attack. With it. One down. Even if you destroy our spires, we will get word to Shakuras. Push ahead. Come fight me. Get going. Our I'm under attack. The swarm never rests. Nothing stands in my way. The flash freeze is ending. Dark essence useful. Visibility during flash freeze increased. A flash freeze storm has hit. You have my attention. Out with it. What is it now? Let's get this over with. Get going. Speak quickly. The flash freeze is ending. In a few moments, there will be a flash freeze. Spare no one. You have my attention. Who asked you? Our forces are under attack. What is it now? Yes? Out with it. A flash freeze storm has hit. Get this over with. Flash freeze ending. We should retreat until the next storm hits. What is it now? This world is not. Matriarch essence assimilated. Swarm perfectly adapted to fight in flash freeze storms. Flash 
freeze mode ending. Our forces are under attack. Yes. They have my attention. This world is mine. Out with it. The Protoss forces are now frozen. Just die. Protoss expedition will be unable to contact Shakuras. Now they have to deal with us. We captured a prisoner in the wastes and subdued her, my queen. She says she is a researcher. I didn't order you to take prisoners. Abathur requested it. He wants to dissect her. What's the point? He won't be able to use Protoss genetic material. He likes to try. Actually, keep her alive for now. I might find a use for her. What are your people doing here? We study this moon to see if its rotation can be altered, its climate improved. Do you understand? We are only colonists, and you are killing us. Yes, and if I let you live, you'll call your golden armada and they will kill me. Kill thousands to save yourself. Is that how you justify this? I justify nothing. There is no moral high ground here. Your people have killed billions of Zerg. We are all covered in blood. There may be more on my hands than yours, but in the end, we are both killers. Nefash's brood lives again within the swarm. When the Protoss struck, she fell back to prepared positions in the ice valleys. The Protoss had to hunt her down. She was intelligent, careful, and tenacious. But she made one mistake. She ran away. I have always wished to feel Protoss bores snapping in my claws. May I? No, Zagara. Surely you do not think to show mercy? Violence is a tool. 
I use it when I have to, but a leader uses the right tool for the job. This is a Terran way to think. The Zerg do not use tools at all. To a leader, everything and everybody is a tool. <laughs>